I'm Danielle Michaud at the Madame Center where the Canadian women's senior basketball squad is starting the final phase of camp ahead of the Women's World Championship, now known as the Women's World Cup, in Spain at the end of next month. It's the deepest pool of talent they've ever had and need to cut down from 15 to 12 players, but it's a good problem to have for Coach Lisa Tomitis. We're really putting them into the fire right from the get-go and uh, see what we can evaluate and take away from that to, to get down to our 12. On the catch, be dynamic. Not a fun position to be in by any means. You know, all these women have have uh, definitely shown their shown their loyalty and their their pride in playing for Canada, and they've come every time we've called. And so, uh, that's a that's going to be a tough one for sure. The group is a blend of the best our country has to offer. Olympians, pros from the WNBA and overseas, as well as some young blood to keep things fresh. But even with never-ending schedules, hectic travel, and tired bodies, the decision to represent Canada doesn't take much thought. I always say that coming back to Canada and coming back to Canada basketball, it's like a refresh on the soul. It feels good. It feels like getting back to my roots. With so many people who are so passionate about the game and have so much love and, and come here each and every year and put their all heart and soul into Canada basketball, and that's so much fun to be around. And this is a team now regarded as a legit contender. Currently ranked a program high fifth in FIBA World Rankings, they qualified last summer after winning a second straight AmeriCup title. The trajectory points straight to the podium, somewhere they've never been at a major international tournament. And now you have Canadians playing in the best leagues across the world um, and investing in themselves and investing in getting better. Um, and that attributes to us getting better as a whole. There's a lot of belief there that we can beat anyone and uh, really perform well. So that's, that's fun to see that in the group. Um, and now we kind of have to leverage that for, for results. Trying to build based on the motivation and the, the things that we've done so far, um, that, I think that's the big part for us. Obviously, you want to win a quarterfinal game, get, get to those medal rounds, and that's a big thing for us right now. Before they head to Spain, they'll play a number of exhibition games against top five teams, including the number one ranked United States and arch rivals France, to see where they stack up. The World Cup begins September 22nd. For City News, Danielle Michaud.